So now we have learned how to write passé composé. In the next exercise, we are going to learn to write the passé composé in the negative form. So, répondez à ces questions. We are going to answer the questions in the negative form. So, the first question is, Tu as fait un jogging dimanche matin? So, it is a question. The answer is no. And now, since the question has tu, your answer will be je. Je. And now we know to make a sentence negative, we add ne before and pa after the verb. However, in the passé composé, we have the auxiliary and the past participle. Both are verbs. So, which of these would we apply the ne pa formula to? It is for the auxiliary verb. So, for je, it is a i. Now we have to add ne before and pa after. So next, we see there is a vowel clash here. So we say je ne pa and don't forget to add the participle after that. Je ne pa fait. I do not do. I ha did not do. It is a past participle. And here, all the indefinite articles become the. So, un or yun or de becomes the. The jogging. Dimanche matin. So, how did we do this? We answered the question. To answer the question, we need to change the subject. And we added na and pa, na before and pa after the auxiliary, which is avoir. For je, it is ai. Je n'ai pas fait. And un becomes the. The jogging dimanche matin. So, let us move on to the next sentence. Tu es allé au cinéma? No. Again, tu becomes je. And we have to add ne and pa. So, in, in between these two, we need to fill in the auxiliary. So, est is être. For je, the être conjugation is sui. No, je ne suis pas allé au cinéma. Je ne suis pas allé. So we add it. It's very simple. If you know passé composé, you just have to write the passé composé and add ne before and pa after the auxiliary alone. The final sentence. Tu as vu une exposition? Tu a vu une exposition. So again, tu becomes je. We add ne before, par after. Now the verb here is avoir. For je, it is a i. And there's a vowel clash. So je n'ai pas vu une. Exposition. So, this is how we make the sentence, which is in the passé composé, a negative sentence. So, in this exercise, we answer the questions. So, the questions were in passé composé, we answered in the negative, keeping the passé composé. So, tu as fait un jogging dimanche matin? No, je n'ai pas fait, je n'ai pas fait de jogging dimanche matin. And one more rule we forgot to apply here. Can you say which one is that? Here, I told you definite article becomes the. Indefinite article becomes the. So, yun will become the. So do not forget that. I made that mistake. So do not forget that. The next one. Tu es allé au cinéma? 
no, je ne suis pas allé au cinéma. So, the être conjugation for tu and this is the être conjugation for je. And the next sentence, tu as vu une exposition? No, je n'ai pas vu de exposition. So, I hope this was easy for you. We just have to know the rules of passé composé, that is, avoir or être plus the past participle for making it into a negative sentence. Before the avoir or être conjugation, we have to add ne and then we have to add pa before the avoir or être conjugation. Now, we are going to answer the questions in the positive. Reponde, we or professor. So the professor or the teacher is asking questions and we are going to answer yes, we. So the first question, vous avez fait l'exercice? You, have you done the exercise? So we are going to answer yes, we. Vous becomes je. Je. So avez, it is avoir. Ave becomes a i. Now, if you notice the vowel clash, so je. Oui, je fais l'exercice. So, very simple. You just have to answer the question. You only have to change the conjugation accordingly. The next sentence. Vous avez compris la grammaire? Again. We, oui. yes, je, again it is avoir, je compris la grammaire. So all we are doing is changing the subject and the conjugation of the auxiliary verb. The rest is as it is. Now the last sentence, vous avez appris le vocabulaire? So we are answering it in the positive again. We, oui. vous becomes je and again it is avoir, so je appris Le vocabulaire. Now you can answer this question in the plural as well. So if you write nu, no, we, oui, nu, no, and the avoir conjugation for nu no is avant. We, oui, nous avons fait l'exercice. So, you can answer either in the first person singular or first person plural. Oui, j'ai fait l'exercice or oui, nous avons fait l'exercice. The second one, vous avez compris la grammaire? Oui, j'ai compris la grammaire. Vous avez appris le vocabulaire? Oui, j'ai appris le vocabulaire. So now, you know how to write the passé composé. You also know how to answer the questions asked in passé composé. So you know to answer it in the positive as well as in the negative form.